All right. Do you have enough money to retire? I've done this for 20 years. This is without question, without question, the most common thing I hear in my office, I would say every day. Dave, do I have enough money to retire? That's a very, imp I understand why you're thinking that. Kind of important, but kind of stressful. Because if you're about to retire and you have no idea if you have enough money or not, you're gonna freak out. I don't want you freaking out, all right? So let's look at this. So let's give you an example. Um, because you know, a lot of people come in and they say, Dave, you know, they show me all their financial stuff and they say, Dave, here's my stuff and, and is this enough? Like, I have no idea. And my answer, my very honest answer when they ask me the question, do I have enough money to retire? Is, I have no idea. And why is that? Because I don't know how much you're spending. If I don't know how much you're spending, it is impossible for me to give you any advice as far as whether or not you're gonna run out of money. So let's look at an example, very common. Like, you know, I'm not working with multimillionaires. Most of the people I work with, you know, they have a million dollars or less. Uh, so let's say I'm sitting down with someone and they have $400,000. And they say, Dave, I'm retiring tomorrow. I am freaked out. I'm like, you don't have to be freaked out. Let's look at this. I say, how much are you spending each month? Let's take a look at a budget. And they say, well, we put a budget together and we're spending about $4,000 a month right now while we're working. I'm like, well, that's very reasonable, right? You're not driving a Lamborghini, obviously. You're not driving, you don't have a yacht, which is all good. Um, $4,000 a month is very reasonable. So let's say in this situation, let's assume you're married and you both have social security and you're both getting 1,500 a month from social security, which is kind of average. 1,500 a month plus 1,500 a month is $3,000 a month. Uh-oh, you need 4,000, you're getting 3,000. What are we gonna do? I have great news. <laughs> this $400,000 means something, okay? I can't believe how many people make this mistake, and I understand why, but they retire and they say, look, I have $400,000, so how is this gonna work? Okay, so I'm probably gonna live another 20 years, so if I divide 400 by 20 years, that comes out to be about 20,000 a year, so if I divide that by 12 months, what is that, around 1,500 a month. So if I add in this 1,500, that's 4,500. And you're going, oh, well that's kind of good news. I can spend $1,500 a month and be okay. But, right, then you think, well this is only if I live 20 years. What happens if I live more than 20 years? That's scary, right? But the variable that invariably people miss, and I understand why, is they forget that this $400,000 does not stop growing when you retire. It does not freeze in time, which is great news, right? The variable is this $400,000 is going to continue to grow. So I believe very strongly, and this is what I recommend to my clients, that you put your money into a diversified portfolio of stocks and bonds. So uh, you have $400,000, and let's say, so here's your money. What you wanna start doing, it's very simply, you wanna start taking the money that the money is making. Dave, what does that mean? I said, look, your money's making money. I know it doesn't make money every year, but on average, we have a very good idea of how much this is gonna make. So, if we look at how much money it's gonna make each month, we can add that to your social security and you're not actually spending the money. We don't want it going down. We don't need it going up, right? This money is for retirement. So, let's take the money that the money is making. Now, the big question is, if you have your money invested the way it should be in a diversified portfolio, how much money is this? How much money can you get on a monthly basis safely from $400,000?
The answer is, let me do my math, $1,600 a month. So if we add that to the $1,500, Social Security $1,500, Social Security, that is what, $4,600 a month. And you can say, yes, because you're not gonna run out of money because you're not even spending your money. You're just spending what it's making. So using this type of scenario, not only can you be okay indefinitely, even if you live to be 100, but using this, you're gonna end up passing away with what you started with. That's pretty cool, right? Your money keeps working once you retire. It's amazing news. So I hope that helped.